Response evaluation criteria in solid tumors is a set of published rules that define when tumors in cancer patients improve, stay the same, or worsen during treatment. The criteria were published in February 2000 by an international collaboration including the European Organization for Research and Treatment of Cancer, National Cancer Institute of the United States, and the National Cancer Institute of Canada Clinical Trials Group. Today, the majority of clinical trials evaluating cancer treatments for objective response in solid tumors use RESIST. These criteria were developed and published in February 2000, and subsequently updated in 2009. They are specifically not meant to determine whether patients have improved or not, as these are tumor-centric, not patient-centric criteria. This distinction must be made by both the treating physicians and the cancer patients themselves. Many oncologists in their daily clinical practice follow their patients' malignant disease by means of repeated imaging studies and make decisions about continuing therapy on the basis of both objective and symptomatic criteria. It is not intended that these recessed guidelines play a role in that decision-making, except if determined appropriate by the treating oncologist. Eligibility only patients with measurable disease at baseline should be included in protocols where objective tumor response is the primary endpoint. Measurable disease, the presence of at least one measurable lesion. If the measurable disease is restricted to a solitary lesion, its neoplastic nature should be confirmed by cytology histology. Measurable lesions, lesions that can be accurately measured in at least one dimension with the longest diameter of per mil 20 yenum using conventional techniques or a per mil 10 yenum by spiral CT scan. Non-measurable lesions, all other lesions, including small lesions longest diameter, 